Let me, uh, let me take a little tour with you if you're not busy for a second and find out some of the tools and some of the people who work on the news as it comes in. This is in no sense a studio. This is really a working news center. The news actually is written and put together here in front of your eyes and will be every morning. Uh, this uh, character here, for example, is Jack Les Cooley, who is a very warm-blooded character. Jack and I are old friends from the Grouch Club days. You heard that wonderful show of Jack's on the West Coast a few seasons ago. Jack will be my right hand, left hand, and probably middle head much of the time. This is a desk where some of the news is put together and some of the features are assembled by uh, pretty girls like Mary Kelly, who's talking to who you're talking to. I have the weather bureau waiting for you, Dave. Oh, that's right. Yeah. You got your electric typewriter waking to? Mm -hmm. This is a, a fantastic machine. If you can get real close to it, it sounds like a machine gun. Isn't that pretty? How fast? Yeah, <laughs> finally beat him. Uh, these are our tape recording machines that put down the voices of people all over the world who may have spoken during the night or who may speak on our early morning program. We'll record them for rebroadcast later. Judd, I hope you're all lined up there. This is the uh, telephoto machine. Anybody coming in? Yes, we're taking a picture now from San Francisco oh. of the 25th Division. Of what? The 25th Division. Well. Good enough. See, the picture will come in on this machine. We'll show it to you every minutes after it was taken. The print we show you will still be wet, but you won't be able to feel it at home, I hope. Uh, let's look up here. Much of meet Buck Prince. Buck is our overseas news editor. Buck, who we got on the circuit this morning? Uh, well, Dave, we got London standing by, and we got Franker standing by. You got London there? Well, let me have a can yeah. here. Hello, London. Hello, London. Stand by, London. London, is that Romney Wheeler? Hey, New York. Good morning, Romney. This is the first of the NBC series of Today Broadcasts. Well, uh, Dave, here in London, we're pleased and proud to be part of this exciting new experiment. Well, sounds like we're both pretty happy. What's the big news story in London this morning, Romney? Well, Dave, before you sign off, I want to give you the latest on those two ships that are breaking up in a storm on the English coast this morning. Go ahead. Well, for a while, I thought we had another Captain Carlson on our hands. The French steamer Hagen went aground on the Goodwin Sands last night and broke in two. Dawn, her lifeboat got out to her and took off 37 crewmen, but Captain Maurice Landro wouldn't leave his ship. But just a few minutes before I came on the air here, I got word that the lifeboat has made a second trip to the wreck, and Captain Landro has been brought safely ashore. Good news, Romney, and thank you from London. Uh, Buck, put me under Frankfurt All there, right, will you? just a minute, Dave. We turn our non-system monitor selector right. to 13. Hello, Ed Hawker in Frankfurt. Yeah, hello, Dave. Hello, greetings from Frankfurt, Dave. Yeah, there. Good to hear your voice, Ed, from the old days you, here. Tell me the big news story in your part of the world this morning. Dave, the, the uh, big news right here in Frankfurt at the moment is the weather. We had our first real snowstorm of the night. The first snowstorm of the winter, and it's really chilly over here today. You're not alone. Thank you very much, Ed. They're from Frankfurt in London, and we can take you to any place in the world, or Buck can with his magic wires and overseas transmitters. Uh, it was good for me to talk to Ed Hocker there because we were page boys together here in Radio City about 400 years ago. I want you to meet another friend of mine, Jim Fleming. Jim is our news editor who handles all the news as it comes out of the machine and back. Jim's uh, background for this is pretty dandy. You may have remembered the wonderful war correspondent work that he did. He covered the Cairo and Tehran conferences. And Jim was in Moscow for a long time until, how would you put that? You objected so strongly to the censorship uh, <coughs> they ejected me there. <laughs> I didn't want to say yeah. thrown out, but <laughs> it's ejected a pleasure and an honor, I guess, to be admitted from there, isn't it? It's a pleasure to be with you, Dave. Good kind. Yeah. We'll have Jim with regular quarter hour reports, 15 minutes after and 15 minutes up every morning. Here are the, uh, the guts of the place. This is where the machines do the news and bring it right into us. Here's the United Press teletype in this corner. And International and AP over here, all the news services feed into here. And let me uh, make a point. See all these newspapers here? This is not a program from New York to you someplace if you don't live in New York. This is a program from America to America so that the guy in one city knows what the people in other cities are feeling and thinking. That's why we fly in the newspapers from most important American cities every day. The airlines do a wonderful job for us. They fly them in and actually the morning papers. Here's the Minneapolis Morning Tribune Monday morning, this very morning. And here it is and a guy who lives in Wilmington, Delaware can see that the big story in Minneapolis is Truman withdrawing Clark's appointment to the Vatican, uh, or a dog leads rescuer to frozen woman. So that the whole country, by means of this show, 
is more closely put together. We hope to do that. Got some pictures just came off? Yes, we'll leave some of them earlier during the day. Oh, well, we'll show them then a little later in the day. Thought maybe that was a wet one like I just told you about. We, uh, we hope to do all this and not get stuffy about it. We hope to keep you more free, more informed, because I believe, as I hope you do, that an informed people tends to be a free people. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.